Okay, so I'm a little bit surprised myself that this is happening again, but there's a huge update to this game called King's Way, which I played a couple years ago, and I really like this game. This is a really fun indie game with some creative ideas. I just did most of the things that were to do. And um, to my surprise, the developer got in touch and said that my streams helped bring like some of the community to the game and that they were a very positive and great community. So that actually means a lot to me. And also the fact that there's a huge update here is really cool. There's a new player class, um, gameplay options button, world size, enemy screen speed, uh, you know, UI quality of life stuff, blacksmith event, new quests, areas, enemies, secret, necromancer, tons of new skills, lots of balancing. Now, if you haven't seen me play King's Way, well, I mean, maybe a lot of people haven't. But I'm going to play it again. Unfortunately, my progress seems to have been wiped. But I'm going to try my best to remember this and um I'm going to uh I'm going to see how it goes. Keep in mind, you could import your own characters. So I remember there was like Meat was like a player one time, or I don't know if Meat was a thing at the time, but like Scoot, uh, Gordon Ramsay, of course. This dude's fine. So I'm going to name him Vine, which rhymes with fine. So instead of Necromancer, I'm just going to go for uh, War Adventurer, just, just to learn how to play the game. World scale. Um, I'm just going to do everything normal because I haven't played this in a while. I want to actually like figure it out. Add another gift for 10 gems. I have no gems. Such is the problem of losing my, my progress. But as you can see here, it's like an OS. The yellow circles in the map are map nodes. Click a node to travel. Some locations have events that trigger when you arrive. You must deal with the event before you can continue traveling. So there's a battle dummy. Maybe we could use a little bit of music. Oh man, I remember the music. I'm gonna lower it a little tiny bit, but... Okay, so battle dummy, you basically, yeah, you wait for your loading bar. <laughs> this is published by Adult Swim, for anyone wondering, but yeah. You will encounter battles while traveling, as well as in events. If you encounter an enemy too powerful, you can try to escape. I got pretty addicted to this game a while back. There's a supplies chest. One free potion per adventure. Oh, you drag it over to your bag, that's right. Oh, this is wild to play this again. I'm playing it in full screen this time, so I have more window room. This is the King's Land. The King's Castle is to the east, but be careful traveling to the east too quickly. There are powerful monsters closer to King's Castle. Take your time, get some experience on the way. You got a quest. We here at Adventure Corps are here to guide you on your pilgrimage to the King's Castle. First thing we want you to do is get acquainted with the Guild. The Guild is an organization that employs outsiders like yourself to do various tasks around the land. Their rewards will be essential to your journey. Bring them the letter that you brought here and they'll take it from there. You can find Guild outposts at any fort and in some small villages. forget that you can inspect and try to do that and see what that is. Hooded figure approaching. They look scared. Approach. They ask for help. Give potion. Reputation increases. And then tells me about a treasure. Distance 58. Uh, 
Unlock treasure. I don't have a, a key. Whoa! Avoid arrow. Oh, I didn't avoid it. I got a way crystal and a deft travel robe of senses. One agility, plus 4% magic item find, plus 2 travel distance. So I don't have the appropriate level for that. Corpse eater. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. There's a, uh, there's a thing here. You can block. And then unblock. I'm gonna play this like shit just because I don't remember how to play the game, but... Skull Wand. Required level 5. You know, I'll take it for sure. You know what I forgot to take? I forgot to take that robe. I left it in the fucking treasure chest before. Oh well. There's a gang of bandits, they look bloodthirsty. There are two of them. Let's talk to them. They don't want to talk. They want to fight. Okay. See, there's a, there's a skill to it. Like, knowing when to stop blocking and knowing when to attack, which I'm performing very poorly at the moment. The bandits try to get away. Okay. I'll attack the other bandit. But yeah, this update seems pretty substantial. Let me loot. It has a bandit blade. An antidote for poison. Let's search for this treasure. They were hiding a treasure. Effigy and a full potion. Nice. Choose a skill. Okay, so add one fire damage to next attack. Critical focus. Chance to critical hit 4%. I'll learn that skill. And then you can swap out battle skills too. That's right. Okay. Okay, let me double check here. I can also increase my uh, stats. Attack speed. I definitely like the attack speed. Okay, so there's an inn here, there's, uh, quests for the guild. We submit the summons, and we get the supplies bag. And it's just a basic set of supplies. Okay. Keep the bag. <laughs> I don't know why, but... Weapon shop. I have a broken sword at the moment. Let me try the... Required level 3. Okay, that's not gonna happen. Go this way. New message, lost shipment. You come across an enchanted healing fountain. Let's, let's drink. 
and I'll drop a gold. Make a wish. How much gold do I have? Forty-four. I don't know if leaving the stuff in the fountain is, is good, I don't remember. <laughs> Fuck. Deserted home, do you enter? Um, there's several rooms. Let's go to the uh, basement. There's a lock chest. Unlock. With the key open, we get a cleaver and a robe. Check the library. There's a uh, paper with strange symbols drawn on it. Okay. Bookcase has a scroll of heal. Cast skill. Oh, okay, cool. Now we have heal. Oh, wait, no. I don't know if I have it or if I just used it that one time. Bedroom. There's a ghoul. Yeah, the scroll I, I didn't actually get like, the ability to use said scroll, but I could get it here. I'll learn it, and now it's on my hotbar. Oh, right, the fake Indiana Jones music. <laughs> There's a... a bed here. Okay, we rested in the bed. There's the King's Lost Shipment. We're gonna check and see. So damage one to three. This has got damage two to two. Oh, we're gonna use the Bright Blade to start. Ring of Strength is Vitality and Strength. This effigy here requires Intellect. The Skull Wand requires a lot of Intellect. This robe has got Defense 2 and 13 Magical Power. That's better. I don't know if you can use a heal outside of battle. I'm not sure. Lost shipment. A location has been added to your world navigator. There's a dark hooded figure and there's some tre a treasure. Um, we'll sell you the mysterious item. I'll buy it. Deft Owl Shield of Purity. Required level 4, but not bad. That's actually pretty good. Uh, talk rumors. Those eerie monoliths showed up a few days ago. I wonder if they're here to help. I hear they react when you give them a magical item. Fungaloid. Is that a Devo song? Oh yeah, they can make little... I forgot you can... Uh, they can make little monsters sometimes. Living seed. Is that like tadpoles? There we go. Got 
gonna cast heal. Long sward. Required strength 10, required level 4. That's gonna take a while before I can use that. And it's a very basic weapon. come across a group of thieves. They look dangerous. Let's talk to them. They're carrying stolen goods. I'll offer you a bribe not to tell anyone what you've seen. Sure. Reputation decreased slightly. How's anyone gonna know about that? About that? There's a cave here. Alright. Out the cave. Beast Eye. Maybe another quest item. Great. I just fucking threw it away by accident. I gotta remember to take that stuff before I move. Skeletons in your area. Hot skeletons looking for. I probably said that years ago. Requirement four skulls reward traveler's ring. Oh, I don't have the skulls for that. All right. Okay. View cart. Check out. Yeah, a lot of this is coming back to me now, and I'm like... This game was fucking fun. Oop! Behind the... Ah! That... Oh, man. Slightly slower attack that deals 150% of player's max damage, which briefly stuns the target. Costs magic. I'm gonna upgrade my critical focus. Axe. Orb. My bag is too full to fit orb. Okay. Now it's not. Required strength nine. This is offhand. It does damage in your offhand. Oh, it's a little dungeon. I forgot about this stuff. Hellworm. escaping. Ah. Come across a treasure chest that is being guarded by a creature. Remember this fella. I like how they just spam you with ads. That's their attacks.
hot cultists in your area. Silver Wand of Haunting. Minus four strength, damage to undead. Magic regeneration. There's a club here. Kind of poop. And Book of Clairvoyance. You learn the skill Clairvoyance. Okay, I need one more intelligence to learn that. stuff. Silver Wand. Cultist Robe. 8% damage to Demon. Hmm. This is Defense 6. This is Defense 2, but more magic. I think... Yeah, I think uh, the answer is clear there. Drink from the blessed water to cleanse your body. You do not need to be cleansed. Remnants of a ritual here. A series of circles are drawn on the ground. Strange items are scattered. An old book is in the center. Scroll of Summon Skeleton. Can only be used in combat. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I didn't take the book. Oh. Fuck. Uh, magic points there. Damn. Okay. Uh... Gotta throw some stuff away now. Mystic Hand. Strap Armor has five defense. Okay, that's not great. Then you have, um, Magic Regeneration offhand. We can get rid of that Book of Heal. Learned Heal too, that's great. It's extremely useful. Ancient book. Use. You lack the knowledge to read this book. I mean... I'll take it. No. <sighs> Man. 
You can unlock hotkeys. Well, that sucks. I was just getting into that. Fuck. Uh, I'll unlock a shield. Your adventurer has died. Do you want to bury them? Choose a memento. I'm going to choose the owl shield because that was pretty good. Oh, this guy's good. Yeah, I like this guy. Rick. Choose class. I'm going to do adventurer again just because I want to learn. Start with the owl shield. Probably health would have been a, a better thing. Little boat. this again. This time it's going to be better. Be good. Can't use this item yet. Oh, I need required level 4. Ooh. Mighty Ring of Health. That's good, but I need level 2 for that, so got a little ways to go there. Not too much ways, but some ways. As long as they don't go behind the window, then I'm good. Every time, at the start of every battle, your first attack is 40% faster. Hmm. Gonna go for heal again. They are injured, they want help. There's a location of a treasure here. Oh, thank you, hooded figure. Uh, uh. Sorry, leather helm. over there. Probably get my ass fucking handed to me. All I had to do before was heal, and I would have been a lot better off. Mighty Bone Club. Plus two strength, but zero to two attack. Well, how's that gonna work? Uh, overall, a, an upgrade. sucks is not being able to see your health when, um, you know, shit goes down, when you have, like, a window moving around. Limited time offer. Okay, we got a quest.
Forgotten Dwelling Hall. Take the paper. Side room. Everything's covered in dust. Unlock the chest. Oak staff. Book of Clairvoyance. I don't have the stats to do this yet. Okay. Basement. Oh no, a skeleton in the basement. Usually it's skeleton in the closet. This time it's skeleton in the basement. thing. Beacon. Monolith. Hmm. Poison dart. Okay, new skill. Um, critical focus again. Put a map of the island in your storage box. Go to any guild outpost to pick it up. Party Ring of Haunting. Level 5 required. Decent ring, though. What do I need for clairvoyance? 7. Eh, fuck it. Let's get, let's get it. Learn skill clairvoyance. See farther. Okay. Little fungus fella, please. Yeah, it can get a little crazy with the multitasking, but... That's part of the charm of the game. Living seed, I know that's for quests where you have to turn in living seeds to get an item. Skeletons in your area again. Make offering. Uh, make, what do I, uh... M make offering? This, this skill burn too, I'm gonna try that. Learn skill burn. Um, make offering, huh? You get one skill point. That's actually pretty great. Yeah, I'm very happy with that. Let's see if I can also get that star. Oh, fuck, cultist. Oh, I can't heal anymore. Oh, fuck.
That was close. Upgrade healing. Loot deft ring of warding. Okay. Now's not the time, friend. Oh, I just used the thing I shouldn't have used. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, I can use the owl shield now. Silver Wand, Lady Ring of Frenzy. Okay, I'm gonna stay here now for a second. Vitality can go up. Um, Silver Wand is magic regeneration. Mighty Ring of Frenzy is three strength, three critical chance. The Ring of Warding is more magic power. Ring of Haunting, I need level five. Still want to go down to the quest area. Probably gonna die, aren't I? Not yet, though. Not yet. Cultist robe. Finally, get some armor. Cult mask. Other uh, demon ward. So okay, that's a quest item. Okay, so the robe is six defense. This uh, cult mask is four defense. That's better than the leather helm, I'd imagine. It is. Ooh, I don't like all these cultists appearing. doing enough damage. Oh my god. The luck. Holy fuck. Um, that was very lucky. Before I do that, I need to... I need, I need to do thing. I need to upgrade. Um, I don't know what Curse does. I think it lowers a stat, maybe? Level 7. This is level 6.
Hooded figure is holding some treasure and doesn't notice you. Sell you the mysterious item. Okay. It's an owl shield. behind the window. That fucking sucks. Oh man, fungus. You've arrived for... Hurry, limited time offer. Free potions for guild members. And you're you're too late. Wow. You're you're too late. You approach one of the three guardian beacons. The ground is littered with um stuff. Read warning. Uh, corpses. Light the three beacons to open the path to the king. This beacon is guarded by Kaital. Alright, well, it was a good try. <sighs> it was a good try. You died. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. God damn it. All right, well, I'm going to continue playing, but man, I am not going to fight Kaitol again. Shit, that's like post-game stuff, I think. Just unlock the lucky coin. Perfect. Irio. Hmm. Whatever. Okay, well, I, I was actually good at this game at one point. You can cap all you want, but I was. Boat area? Mark's location of treasure dies. Refuses to elaborate. Lesser jelly appears. Oh, they split. Potion of magic, that's nice. Okay, well, that's good to have. Enchanted Healing Fountain. Let's grab the treasure. Open. 
Okay, so we got a shield, level two shield, and a dark club. Minus three regeneration, but it does one to ten damage. That is very interesting. And I just leveled up to heal, of course. Plus six percent magic item find, cool. There's a wanderer, sit a wanderer sitting on a rock in the middle of the ocean. I'll buy the mysterious item. It's, um, it's rotten. Okay. <laughs> Those eerie monoliths showed up a few days ago. I wonder if they're here to help. They react when you give them a magical item. Fucking love this damage. Oh, we're gonna forest area. Guild message Are you strong enough? Strong enough to kill Maple Story mushrooms. I'm gonna get vigilance this time. Let's see how that works out. Are you strong enough? Uh, kill skeletons at the location for a special helmet. Get an orb, crescent potion, and potion. I think the crescent potion grants one stat point. That's cool. Offhand requires intellect, right? Grim leather garb of stone. Minus 13% damage to undead. Requires level 4. Okay. I don't know if that forest stuff is new. It might be. It's hard to remember. Am I losing health from this club? I guess that's what is meant by negative regeneration. Yeah, I'm losing health. At least I'm killing boners. Approach the skeletons. They're blocking the entrance to the tomb. There's there's a lot of skeletons here. Much needed level up. This club is too powerful not to use, even if it does decrease my health a little bit. Uh, 
Now would be a great time to get that quest. You can hear the rattling of bones. Okay, let me level up before I do this. Jeez. Okay, what do I need here? I got a club that has plus six, six strength. That's not bad. And that won't kill me. But the attack is very... Mm, very... Mm. This rotten one has minus two vitality. I'm gonna just wear the, uh, the grim one. The Orbiot. I don't need that. Hmm. Treasure. Oak Staff, which has Burn 2. That's what I was using before. It's not great. This is fine. I'll just wear this armor instead of this one. I'm also going to switch to that while I'm traveling. Problem is there's a... There's some skeletons. We really need to stop them from fighting, you know? Hey, it's me, Vinny. It's me, Vinny. Is that his thing? Doesn't he say that? Hey, it's Vinny. It's me, Vinny. Except he says his name and not mine. level up before I fight the boss down here. That's so Indiana Jones. Every time I hear it, I'm sorry, I can't not mention it. Oh, there's a skeletal mage. Skutal mage. Scroll of Poison 2. Invisibility Potion and an Orb. Yeah, I have a lot of skulls. That'll be great for that skull quest if it ever appears. Plus 12% block. Compare that to this shield. It's an upgrade. Blood skeleton appears. Ow. Oh, this thing hits.
The tomb has been cleansed. Reputation increased moderately. This is level 6 ring. Skill clairvoyance, extra damage, everything. That's a great item. It's it's even yellow. Wheel shield. That that seems really good. Long cleaver. Required strength 18. Uh, this is all pretty great stuff. Strange stone charm immune to curses. Nice. Uh that. How much is this? Orb. That's a weight of six. These skulls weigh one each. Okay. I'm assuming this stuff weighs stuff too. Would be nice to increase my uh, inventory. Like my carry weight. What am I going to do? Strength 14, level 7. I can't use the item yet, but I can keep it in that slot. And I just have to hope that I don't die. Defense 7. Leather garb confirmed more powerful. Pointy hat. Plus 5% lifesteal. Cool. Effigy plus 1 damage. Uh, reflected and... Oh, damage reflected is interesting. the skeleton shack. Oh, yeah. Give it this rotten armor. Forgot I even had that. Takes your offering, but nothing happens. Oh, I needed- I think I needed to give it a blue thing. That's a good attack. Not enough magic. Oh, it uses magic, right. My health is getting, like, dangerously low.
Forgotten Dwelling again. Unlock treasure chest. Mighty Ring of Fury. Attack speed, that's pretty, pretty good. Um, Book of Axe Mastery. Huh. Skeletons in your area. I got it. Four skulls for a ring. You can switch weapons, I guess, mid combat, which is cool. So axe mastery is increases damage while we're, while wielding an axe, of course. Um, magic arrow, shield, uh, magical. You know, I'm gonna do sword mastery. That might have been a waste, actually. Now that I think about it. I'll be able to use this shield soon. Guild down there. Could be a nice snack. Could eat one of these jellies. Get hungry along the way, you know? The King's Way. There's a suspicious group of bandits. Let me talk to them. They don't they don't want to talk to me. Oh god, they're powerful. One bandit down. Fuck. You can't escape bandit. I had no idea the bandits were going to be that powerful that quickly. Man. Um. Okay. I'm gonna stop the recording here and then I'm going to. I gotta cook and make some food for myself and then I'm gonna do another one later and add it to this. This game's still a lot of fun. I'm just pretty fucking bad at it. Plus 10 health points. That could be good. I'm gonna save my gems. Okay, I'll be- I'll return momentarily, but yes, I- I- Game is hard. I was better at one point. Um, more in a moment. Sorry. Okay, I have to get that out of there. Alright. It is now several hours later. As I cooked food, ate food, watched some more of that get back stuff napped by accident and um 
end uh, world peace. So we're going to play a little bit more Kingsway. But first, I was at a Friendsgiving event last night and I met up with an old friend. I hadn't seen him in a long time. And honestly, it kind of sucked. He looked like shit. He was really thin. And it just, it goes to show you, you know, you don't know how people are doing before you see them. And it was, you know, years. And I have a picture I thought you might want to see. You know, it's just real weird how people change over time. Also, I thought my face in this looked so intensely ridiculous that someone would meme it or whatever. So, I guess Merry Christmas early. Why well, have I done this? Anyway. Uh... I don't, I don't really care what memento I use. I'm going to try Necromancer. Actually, I'm going to pause this again. I'm going to um, get a nice character. A nice one. Very nice. Frank Gasm the Necromancer. World Seed, no. Well, I'll try the Necromancer. I can't believe I still have my Kingsway folder. It's just... memes. Oh! No, 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 no. Oh man, no. I didn't choose any gift. Fuck it, I don't need no gift. Oh well. What can you do? Totally forgot about the gift. Alright, so... It's been several hours. It feels like it's been... 34 years. Luigi. There's a scared hooded figure. I'm gonna give them a potion. And I'm gonna talk. Oh, a nail club. That's nice. And rumors. Okay. can't use this item yet. What level do you have to be to use a shitty nail club? Well, that answers that question. Oh, I was still blocking. You can kind of shotgun some of these early fights. Okay. Resurrect. Oh, you don't... Okay, you... Okay. Summon a skeleton to fight by your side until the end of battle. Yeah. Well, this is brand new shit, so... Not like I would have remembered it anyway, but it's nice to have new things to look forward to in this playthrough. That's why I love when a developer updates a game that's tried and true. It's been out for years, and suddenly massive update drops. I think another thing I wasn't doing was I was going too far too quickly and enemies were getting ridiculous. 
I love the little pop-up for the skeleton. You want to travel, you know, vertically a little bit, too. Oh, I, I'm a dumbass. Of course it costs magic to summon skeletons. <laughs> Why wouldn't it? I'll buy the treasure. I don't want to be rude. Acquired level 2. Vitality, magic power. That's, that's pretty... That's pretty nice. And rumors... No. Okay, the skeleton quest has popped up. Oh, there's a little dungeon here. <clears throat> I have milk tea. <laughs> Ass ram milk tea. Oh, I'm almost dead. I lost my resurrect skill. Maybe dungeon was a bad idea this early. It's being guarded by a creature, right? Well, I'm going for broke because I, I can't afford to die here. Well, I could. Just, it would be nice to not die as well. Alright, cool. Alright, this game's a little hard. <laughs> what, what memento am I gonna... Am I gonna do? I wonder if I can import the whole folder all at once. No, sadly not. There's some pretty good older emotes in here. Like that one. Okay. <clears throat> Choosing this gift. That's what I need. I'm good now. I'm really, I've got this. Can you believe I, I completed this game at some point? I almost can't. But yeah, you, you need to spend a little time getting yourself leveled up before you go into a damn dungeon. Now you have to see that Luigi every time. Yeah, the, the summon skeleton, you gotta save those. I'm starting to remember and understand, more understand, <laughs> what stuff one must do.
in this game. There's a monolith over there. If I could get a magic item. Book of Burn. Learned Burn. Okay. Wanderer. They're holding treasure. I'll buy it. Book of Heal. Learned Heal. Lost shipment. There's a fountain of healing. Well, I'm gonna get the, uh, the thing. I'm gonna replace burn with summon skeleton. You can also get rid of block, which is probably like a terrible idea, but you could. Skellington meet Skellington. I'm gonna put the skulls in the supply bag. Just for organizational purposes. really have a magical item I'd want to give up, but I'm, I'm going to make this offering. One skill point. I, th I think that's probably worth it. I'm going to upgrade Summon Skeleton. Which also means I'm going to need to increase the intellect soon. Increase the old intellect. Just read a book. That's it. That's all you have to do. I was hoping I could find a treasure chest down here. I just, I found a skeleton down here instead. Hot skeletons in your hometown. Great heal this time around. Oh, mimic. Oh, oh God. That's going to require some skeletons to help me out. Book of Axe Mastery. 
strap armor. Oh, skull mask sounds fun. You get life steal. Can't wear it yet, but soon. It was worth it to quest down here. Now, I remember there being a timer on the overworld. There was a, a thing where you had to... Like, not die and not take too long, either. Leather garb. That's seven. This is five, and this is requires level seven. I'll bring it with me, but I'll probably find something better before then if I can fucking live that long. We'll see. square before I do. Ugh. I guess things are grayed out when, when you can't use it. Oh, it doesn't really show you. You just have to remember exactly how much you have and don't have. I really am terrible at this. Masochism, lose 10% of your math, 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 max health and convert half of the lost health into health magic points. Um... Your skeletons attack 15% faster. Summon a demon. Vigilance. Okay. Um, a passive would be good right about now, so I'm going to learn upgraded skeletons. One, this is zero to two. That was a strict upgrade and I wasn't using it. That's really fascinating of me. You can rename things too. You can turn like, like, uh, cock sword. It's the first thing that came to mind. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead, and out of this world. Natural enhancements? Ghost caps. Storage. Map of Kingsway. I see.
armor shop. Um, when do I get to wear this? Level 6. Level 6. Level 6. Everything's level 6. Alright. Just buy some potions. Skull quest. I don't have the skull quest. Got to sell that thing for five gold at least. So that sells for three. Skull quest was not for this many skulls. I'll sell one of those. Oh, I still need too much gold to get crescent. area. Try to get close to the quest area without dying. Let's see. so hard to block. When a little fella appears. Five. Better skeletons. I like the idea of a skeleton focus. Got a hearty ring of strength. Also level six required. So later we'll be able to use that. That'll be nice. Um, we're gonna do two intellect. Uh, one intellect. Two intellect. One agility. Wanderer greets you. Rumors. Oh, there's a treasure. Go down to that treasure. Who wants best deal on potion? Skeletons are pretty good now. Skeleton versus skeleton. Boner v. Boner. A bigger uh, event than Batman v. Superman. Limp leather garb of health. Oi. Who are you calling limp? You get regeneration, but minus attack speed. Required strength seven. Okay, well, I can wear that next level. Maybe I don't want to wear it, but I'm going to wear it anyway, I think. There's a creature guarding this, so we're going to do two skeletons here. You escaped. Okay. Just wasted stuff. That's fine. Uh, but I lived. Required strength 16 and required strength 13. And agility for this saber. Good weapons, but the type of class I'm playing, it's not gonna be easy. Cloaked figures wanna fight.
Gonna need both them skeletons for this one, I think. That got a little scummy. Full potion. Oh, thank God for the full potion. Potion of attack is good. I'm gonna use the full potion. Uh, limp leather garb. What was this again? Right, okay. Bandit's tooth, that's a uh, quest item. Potion of attack temporarily increases attack speed. Do not drink more than three a day. You do, you're addicted. I guess I didn't need the full health potion. I just did this. Eh. Scroll of Heal 2. Okay. That's just a free scroll. Got a treasure chest, Book of Poison. Learned Poison. Leather Gob. Leather Gob. where I can, I can, if I needed to, put these things in storage. So I'll keep the thing that maybe I could use. If it, that's 16 strength. I only have five. Never mind. These are both going in storage. I may never use them. I will buy a potion of magic, though. items in here. They, they weigh quite a bit. Four beast eyes can get you a potion coupon. I don't have four. Good to know, though. What other quests were there? Ghost caps. Map, we got that one. Lost shipment, we can do that now. Investigate the lost shipment. Looking around the caravan, you find a torn up package. Several torn up packages with their contents scattered on the ground. I'm gonna look for the lost shipment. You do find a trail of debris. The trail ends and I'm fighting a, like a rat man now. That's nice. I didn't realize rat man was gonna kick my ass this hard. Never got a chance to use that thing. Not ever. Nope. Ugh.
Okay. This is a blast from the past. Okay. I'll do the necromancer again. And I'm gonna do both health and... and gold, and I'm gonna try to make this my best run yet. Little by little, I have learned more and more. More of the things. This could only go very well. Okay, Wanderer gives me treasure already, but I'm down a potion. Mighty Ring of Haste and an orb. So the orb is plus two damage. Required intellect is 10. That's feasible. The haste is move speed and strength. Okay. All right, this is gonna be the best run yet. Why is there another one? It says 8.48 a.m., but it's p.m. in real life. I just noticed that. Oh, God! That was weird. It got confused. It wasn't 8.40. It was 8.54 p.m. in real life, but I saw the time on the bottom right, and I was like, wait, that time is... It's the same time. It wasn't. I just got confused. Hardy Spear. Agility 9. Powerful monster, sure. It's the worst thing I could be doing right now is fighting a powerful monster with my uh, level 1. Skeleton. Skeletons are back on the menu. Mighty Ring of Intellect. Very good. Plus two strength, one intellect. That's more a uh, ring of strength than intellect, I'd say. New message from worked, no subject. Have you seen my horsey? His name is Sponge, and he was taken by taken by some bandits. He must be so scared. Please bring him here if you find him. Now, that's interesting. That the horse's name is Sponge when the developer said that my playthrough was something that they enjoyed. Huh. I like the name Sponge for a horse, though. Gotta say. <laughs> that's pretty cool if that's in any way a reference. If it's not, that's still pretty good. Huh. Sacrifice one of those rings for a level up on my skills.
cursed. God damn it. I'll upgrade my skeletons. The map. Okay, that's the map quest. Huh, map quest. Remember that. Healing fountain. I almost don't want to level up my skeletons too quickly, too soon, because then uh, they're going to, you know, be too difficult to summon too many of them. Okay, what offering? We got this Ring of Vitality, which is two intellect, two vitality. One strength, one move speed. One, two strength. I think the haste ring has to go. <clears throat> Inflict one physical damage to target, gain one health point. I'm going to save my skill point until I can upgrade my skeletons. The clot are a group that worship the Sky Eater. They live in tombs underground and resurrect the dead to protect themselves in their forbidden rituals. My horse sponge is missing. Can you help? I realize, though, I don't have access to the healing potion. Or the healing spell. I probably should have purchased more healing. That's worrying. Yeah, I have no healing. Resurrect. But I don't even want to fuck around with bandits right now, so. I just said, fuck it, I'm summoning all my. all of everything I have. Party thief garb, nice. Let's see what I have to I, yeah, I need to figure out a healing thing. This is Agility 9. I'm gonna work towards that. I wanna get that. Okay, now skeletons. hiding something. Book of Chill. Cleaver is better. Cleveland Steamer. Uh, horse Toy? Sponge is written on the tag. Oh, this was the quest? This doesn't have the guild, but we'll, we'll go there and rest at the inn. Uh, 
buy some shoes. Why not? Uh, magic shop. I don't know where to turn in the sponge quest. Please bring him here if you can find him. Oh, oh, I see. Kill skeletons at location. Okay, so now I can just go to the star and, and bring that to, spo to the person. Bring the, the sponge horse. There's a small house. On a tree nearby, there's a poster for the missing horse named Sponge. You knock on the door, a young child immediately opens it. Have you seen my horsey? Give horse toy. Reputation has increased. Thank you. Wait here, and they run inside. They hand you a gift. It's a small pack. You know, I forgot this supplies bag has its own weight. That's how this works. The packs have their own weight to them. Completely fucking forgot about that when I was doing previous runs. That was a nice little quest. If that reference has anything to do with me, I am honored. And if it doesn't, it's just a great name. <laughs> I just am... Sometimes I'm taken aback by the fact that people put references to me in their video games, like in Ultra Kill, which I still haven't played, which is criminal. I should play that soon, because that game is fucking awesome. As someone who's played video game my whole life. It's kind of cool. I'm gonna upgrade Leech to get a little bit more. Uh, a little bit more health per time I use it, which again is not much, but it's... It's enough. Okay, now I have a good weapon. Three to four damage plus one vitality. Not even that much better compared to the cleaver, but pretty good. And I can attack a lot faster too, so I don't even need to use my skeletons for some of the smaller fights. Mighty Ring of Doom. Plus four strength, plus 14% damage to beasts. Kind of nice that I'm two shotting skeletons. I mean, I've learned a lot from my previous deaths. <laughs> it's a sentence you won't hear in application to, like, real-life stuff. Unless, you know, past lives are real. Of course, if you had a past life, you were always a famous person. Or a king. Four beast eyes required. Got none of those.
I'm going to buy this helmet. Excuse me. It's a little, uh, it's fo little foreskin. That's what it is. Foreskin, like kin of the force, like Star Wars. Light helm. Oh man, some good stuff. Kind of better than what I bought. leather shoes. So I'll keep that and sell it. Light Helm has eight defense, but I don't get the strength which I'm going to need if I'm going to wear the Greaves, which has more travel distance, but requires a lot of strength. Yeah, I'll keep both of them now that I know I can actually store them properly. I still need to find a proper town so I can like actually store uh, sell this stuff. Proper town is right up there. There's a campsite. I'm gonna rest up. There's an enchanter. They offer to enchant one of your items for a price. I don't have the money for it. Oh. But why is it buff and naked? Just kind of noticed that. Mystic Hand is offhand, plus five magic points. This is more damage. Oh, magic points sounds good too. Book of Axe Mastery. Deft Robe is 2 Agility and 16 Magic Power, so this is 3 Vitality, Escape Chance. Here. 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 Right, the beacon? That, isn't that where I died last time? Or one of the last times? I think you have to light the beacons and then you can do a thing. The, the like, main story thing, I think. Explode summon. Unsummon any summon to instantly inflict three times their minimum damage to all enemies. Interesting. Spectral shield. 15% chance of poison, chill, stun, or burn an enemy when you successfully block their attack. I like that. And it's passive, too, so that's even better. I'm gonna get the strength thing. I'm gonna wear... Greaves, which I can now wear. Plus five magic points. That's, that's a lot of magic points. Mighty leather garb. Strength 
strength and escape chance. Let's see, this is vitality and escape chance. I'm gonna go for the, I'm gonna wear the strength one. I mean, having more strength as a necromancer is a little weird, but I'm okay with it. Free gold from Adventure Core with a zero. Congratulations, Traveler. You've been selected for an exclusive reward. <laughs> Come to this designated location to collect your free 1,000 gold. Hurry before it's gone. Yeah, I'm not doing that thing now. Two thieves. I can fight the thieves. I haven't actually seen that passive take effect yet. And it blade. Antidote. Search treasure. This is a purple. Doomed skull wand of haunting. Minus 18% damage to demons, but more regeneration, plus damage to undead, plus two magic regeneration. I do a little bit less damage, but man, I think I'm going to use that. I think the, the pros outweigh the cons. just in case. Light Helm is 8 defense, right? Versus 3 and 3 strength. I'll keep the Light Helm with me. Maybe I'll find a better one, or I can enchant that later, I'm not sure. That seems like a wise move. Upgrade your gear! I'm an enchanter looking to help you. Alright, my fungal friend. My fungal friends. Fungalfunny.com. That was a real thing, wasn't it? Well, there's now clippus.c that someone made that's just a repository of clips. So. P 
people make lots of things. The Wanderer gives you 33 gold. Strange altars and dungeons. Be careful with forbidden magic, though. Free gold. It's quiet, but no one seems to be around. Well, let's wait a little longer. There's a weird noise coming from behind a boulder. Let's investigate. It's an ordinary rock, but behind is a large hole big enough to fall into. It looks deep. Let's jump in. It's too deep to climb back out. Oh yeah, cool. Free gold. Yeah, realfreegold.cock. The one time I don't block. Whoa, that got a little bit squirrely. Chainmail plus one is nine defense plus one defense. That's ten defense. This I like better, truthfully. But I'm going to keep the chainmail in one of my bags so I can sell it later. Uh, new skill. Faster attack, uh, faster skeleton attack. For some reason, I thought unsummon said unsubscribe. Which would be thematically appropriate. Oh, nothing here. What else did I loot? I got a lucky coin, which is a charm. It just, I guess, increases luck. Mighty Ring of Doom, plus five strength, plus, that's a straight upgrade. Welcome to the Petus Enlargement Pill Tunnel. Spear. Five to six damage. Agility, minus 17% damage to beasts, but plus 8 agility. Damn. It's, oh man, there's some fucking wacky rings. Bright ring of vitality, and they offer to buy it for 13 gold. Now, where's that? Yeah, you can, um... Hmm. 
Yeah, you can you can have it. Talk rumors. And there's another skill point. New skeletons just dropped. Try to head down to that quest down there. Uh oh. Why did I unsummon the skeleton? Why did I unsk Oh, I didn't have the thing. Okay. Okay. I flew too close to the sun too quickly. However, that was my best run yet. Plus four magic points I'll get for next time. So you get an idea of what the game is all about. I'm going to definitely return to this sometime and try to master the necromancer. This game isn't for everyone, I think, because you have to have like a little bit of planning and patience and you know you, you click that's what it is you click but i got utterly addicted to it when it first came out and it's it was a huge surprise for me because i didn't expect this game to be what it was and it ended up being way better than i expected so if you're into rpgs and roguelites but also operating systems then this is the game for you it's called kingsway so, I don't know, I guess you'll see more of it eventually. But hey, thank you for watching, as always. Uh, it's been fun to revisit what I consider to be a bit of a classic. Also, forced minor meme that came from this game. I won't tell you what it is until we get to the enemy, but it happened. Alright, goodbye for now.